हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम अगेन टुडे आई विल टीच यू सिंपल एंड कंपाउंड इंटरेस्ट ट्रिक्स एंड शॉर्टकट एज यूजुअल फ्रेंड्स वी स्टार्ट विद सिंपल क्वेश्चन एंड लेटर वी विल मूव ऑन टू डिफिकल्ट वन सो लेट्स स्टार्ट सो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज प्रिंसिपल इज गिवन दैट इज रुपीज फोर थाउजेंड रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट इज ऑल्सो गिवन दैट इज ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट पर एन एम टाइम इज इक्वल टू फाइव ईयर एंड वी हैव टू फाइंड दिस सिंपल इंटरेस्ट एवरीबडी नो सिंपल इंटरेस्ट इज इक्वल टू पी इंटू आर इंटू टी डिवाइडेड बाय हंड्रेड एंड वी स्टार्ट मल्टीप्लाइंग पी इंटू आर इंटू टी एंड देन डिवाइड बाय हंड्रेड बट एज इन आवर एग्जाम वी हैव वेरी लेस टाइम so we can't do such multiplication in our exam so i will tell you the quickest method to find simple interest as quickly as possible so as you know friends simple interest is equal to p into r into t divided by 100 so we can write it as r t divided by 100 into p or we can say that आर टी परसेंट ऑफ टी वी नो आर दैट इज ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव एंड टी इज ऑल्सो गिवन दैट इज फाइव सो आर टी विल बी ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव इंटू फाइव दैट इज सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फाइव ट्वेल्व इंटू फाइव इज सिक्सटी एंड पॉइंट फाइव इंटू फाइव टू पॉइंट फाइव तो सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फाइव आर टी एंड पी इज ऑल्सो गिवन दैट इज फोर थाउजेंड एंड वी नो हाउ टू कैलकुलेट सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट ऑफ फोर थाउजेंड ऑफ एनी नंबर मैनुअली एज वी डीड इन आवर परसेंटेज सेक्शन वी कैन राइट सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट एज फिफ्टी परसेंट प्लस ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट एंड वी नो फिफ्टी परसेंट इज वन बाय टू वन बाय टू वन बाय टू फोर थाउजेंड प्लस ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट वी नो वन बाय एट वन बाय एट ऑफ फोर थाउजेंड सो हाफ ऑफ फोर थाउजेंड इज टू थाउजेंड एंड वन बाय एट ऑफ फोर थाउजेंड एट वन बाय एट एट फाइव ऑफ फोर्टी दैट इज फाइव हंड्रेड सो सिंपल इंटरेस्ट विल बी टू थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड so if you know how to find percentage you can easily find simple interest without multiplying any number now we move on to our second question before starting the second question friends please click on the like button down below to have more videos like this so second question is a sum of money doubles in 10 years find in how many years it will be travel that is three time at the same rate of simple interest so in this question let's say we have 100 rupees and in 10 years it will become double that is 200 according to this question sum of money become doubles in 10 years and we have to find in how many years it will become triple that is 300 so there are two ways to solve this question friend and i will tell you this simplest one there is a formula friend to solve this question that is n1 minus 1 by mid t1 is equal to n2 minus 1 by t2 uh, according to this question n1 is 2 that is our money is double so n1 is 2 and t1 is 10 year and n2 is also given that is 3 times so n2 will be 3 and t2 we have to find so by putting the value 2 minus 1 by 10 is equal to 3 minus 1 by t2 so 1 by 10 is equal to 2 by t2 That is T two is equal to twenty years. That is our answer. 
and in this question friends remember one thing in this question simple interest is given and if in place of simple interest if compound interest is given then there will be different formula now in compound interest formula will be n2 is equal to n1 t2 divided by t1 so remember this formula also now we move on to our third question third question is what will be the amount and compound interest when rupee 10000 is deposited in a bank at 10% per annum compounded annually for 3 years so in this question principal is given that is rupee 10000 rate of interest is given that is 10% per annum and time is 3 years and we have to find the amount and compound interest so there is a formula friend for amount that is amount is equal to p into 1 plus r by 100 the power t p we know 10000 given rate is 10% and time is 3 years so we have put the value 10000 into 1 plus 10 by 100 the power 3 that is 10000 into 110 by 100 into 110 by 100 into 110 by 100 usually we know this formula and we skip these two step we start with this step principal is 10000 and 10% is given rate of interest so we simply add 10 to 100 that is 110 100 and 3 times we have to take as time is 3 years so we write 110 by 100 110 by 100 and 110 by 100 2 0 से 2 0 cancel again 2 0 से 2 0 cancel and again 2 0 से 0 cancel now we have to multiply 11 into 11 into 11 that is 1331 that is our answer that is equal to amount now we abhi also have to calculate the compound interest then compound interest will be amount minus principal that is 13310 minus 10000 that is equal to 3 310 that is our answer now we move on to our fourth question now fourth question is 5000 rupees are separately invested on compound interest and simple interest at rate of 10% per annum find the difference between both interest after 2 years so in this question principal is given that is 5000 rate of interest is given that is 10% time is also given that is 2 year and we have to find the difference between the compound interest and simple interest so there is a formula friends for the difference when time is equal to 2 years difference is equal to p r square by 100 square that is p we know 5000 and r is 10% so 10 into 10 is 100 and 100 plus square that is 10000 so we cut 30 30 10 10 10 that is 5 into 10 is 50 that is our answer remember friends this formula is applicable only when time is given that is 2 year if in place of 2 year if time is equal to 3 years then formula will be difference is equal to p r square 300 plus r 
डिवाइडेड बाय हंड्रेड की क्यूब सो रिमेंबर दिस फॉर्मूला आल्सो इफ टाइम इज इक्वल टू थ्री सो दैट इज गाइज फॉर दिस वीडियो इफ यू गाइज वन सी मोर वीडियोज लाइक दिस क्लिक ऑन दिस सब्सक्राइब बटन डाउन बिलो and as always thanks for watching